those night vision cameras right now. <laughs> Hello my friends, I hope you're doing quite well. I will explain why I look like garbage in a second here. Today, tonight rather, I thought of a pretty impromptu photo shoot idea, I guess. I have these colored light bulbs that I always wanted to mess around with and take pictures with. I bought them for an art project, basically with the same ideas I have tonight, and it worked pretty okay. The only problem is I have two light, light, what do you call it with the lights in the ceiling? I have two ceiling lights? I don't know. But I have two of them in my room, which is weird in itself, um, but I don't have any like portable lamps or anything to put the light bulbs in, so I'm going to be using them. So I can't control where the lights are and I'm going to have to position myself in relation to how I want it lit on myself because they're going to be self-portraits, I forgot to say that, but yeah. I decided to shoot on digital as opposed to film because it's going to be dark and I just don't feel like dealing with it. I don't want to deal with the stress. I want this to be a de-stressing experience. I haven't shot on my digital camera in actually a really long time, like months. I've only been shooting film for so long and I've just been vlogging with my camera and doing video and you know not taking actual pictures and I just kind of miss having that flexibility <laughs> flexibility to go in and like make sure they're turning out okay you know and I wanna and I really miss just editing I guess so that's what we're doing tonight for my makeup I kind of wanted it to look pretty natural but like tired-ish if that makes sense so so basically for my eyebrows I just used a brow gel to make them look really messy and whatnot and I didn't pluck them and then for the rest of my face I just put like concealer on some of the acne and like the extra red spots because I have a lot of redness on my face and just a little bit on my lips which it kind of came off already but just to make them look more bitten which I didn't really need to do much of because okay <laughs> and then I just put like some eyeshadow like down here-ish to like accentuate uh, dark circles under my eyes which again I didn't need to do that much of but you know and then I just put mascara on and that's it that is it if you care about that that way you know okay I'm gonna go and put these light bulbs in and hopefully they work let's see so here's the one light bulb and then here's the other one <laughs> so if you're wondering why I have two light bulbs in my room it's because this is the main one in the room and then over here was like a closet and we like knocked the wall out to make the room bigger so yeah that's why there's two lights in here let's see how this works first before I change the color of the lights I'm going to show you what I plan on wearing and basically it's this yellow jacket that I thrifted, which I may or may not go with. Sorry, this isn't an ideal um, way of showing you, but also my room is a mess. But what else is new? Water is what? I don't know. And then I'm going to do just this black bralette underneath, I think. I might just go with this without the jacket. Um, we'll see. I don't know. We got one. Let's try and change the color. Red. Oh wait. Yeah, no. Red. 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 White. That's blue. Red. Green. Okay, cool. We did it. We got one. We can do this. I literally sat down the remote for this blue light somewhere so I would remember that it was for that light. And now I literally have no idea where I put it, so there's- oh, found it. Okay, so they both work. Sorry that it's so dark, but 
You know, I can only do so much, okay? The problem is, they're very directional, so they only point towards the ground, so I don't know if it's gonna work or not, but let's see. Okay, so this is what it looks like with the lights all off. Sorry if you can't see very well, but this corner is lit up really nicely, I guess probably because it's a corner and there's walls for the light to reflect off of, but this other light is not. <laughs> it's literally, I mean, it's on yellow right now, so I'm going to try and change it to a different color, but I mean, the bottom, the ground looks kind of cool because it's like a rainbow, but this is not what I wanted. Let me try and change the color if I can see in the dark here to red. Ooh, spooky. I'm scared. So I'm gonna go and roam the house and see if I can find a different lamp I can use, but I'm pretty sure we don't have one. And if I don't find one, I'm just going to use one light, I think. Which is kind of boring, but two lights is obviously not going to work, so. <laughs> so I remember that I have this reflector, so I thought I'd try it. And it actually works really well, like if you, I guess it's kind of hard to see on camera, but you can still see like the green that's on this wall and that wall. Ignore, I don't know why the hallway's so red, that must be the white balance, but on my camera, but. Um, yeah, I think if I just shoot in this corner and take all that shit out of the way, it would actually work a little well, maybe, I don't know, we're gonna try it. Okay, so basically I uh, cleared everything out of the way and I'm going to use this wall as a background and then I covered the rest of the stuff up with a blanket. So hopefully it looks okay. So I'm going to set my camera up on the tripod and then let's see how it goes. She heard me calling. She heard me saying. 